I don't want to hit Eileen, but that is like right on top of her. Good job, Eileen. I hear you over there doing the good work. And I'm taking my time to kill everything because then usually they won't respawn. So the, the town of Silent Hill is evil itself. So like, and the way that it works is that it's haunted. So like Silent Hill is a town, like, like, like canonically Silent Hill is a town, like an actual town, like actually had a resort there. But the people and the things that happen in Silent Hill are evil. Like not all people are, not every person in Silent Hill is evil. There's been plenty of people that you meet that like was born and raised in Silent Hill that had bad shit happen to them because of the evil people that happen to be there. I'm thinking of, oh God, what's her name? Oh, she's from Silent Hill 2. What's her name? Anna, I think is her name, or Hannah. Anna or Hannah. Basically, she got SA'd by her own dad, but she was born and raised in Silent Hill. So like... She is in the bad place, basically, because of the bad things that happened to her. So, like, Silent Hill is a lot about trauma, both guilt, like, being a party that has inflicted trauma, or someone who has suffered trauma. And sometimes you're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Like, I don't... We haven't learned what Henry has done or did or experienced to be experiencing this other than the fact that the apartment that he lives in is haunted and connected to people who are connected to Silent Hill. Henry is my main character. Um, oh, would you look at that? Everything's burnt down from when the crazy person set himself on fire. A note is on the ground. Something here, but nothing's, something's here, but nothing's here. I feel something from the well, something missing. Ah, it has begun. Jasper. Jasper, that was his name. I wanted to say Justin and I knew his name wasn't Justin. It seems too normal of a name for Silent Hill. Oh, hi Jasper. How you doing bud? Are you gonna come after me now too? I'd really appreciate if you didn't. Oh, Jasper. What's weird is how did Jasper is supposedly one of... Okay, Jasper, listen. Listen, Jasper. Listen, Jasper. No. I don't have Eileen. Oh, no, I do. Okay, I was like, where's Eileen? Jasper, no. The stone is creepy somehow. Come on, Eileen, we gotta stay away from Buddy Boy over there. He's gonna, ow, do the hurdy. I am trying if you would like run just a little bit faster. And Eileen, for example, I don't think she's also done anything. It doesn't explicitly say that she's done anything bad, but she is living in the apartment building, connected. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. No, 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 Eileen, come. We're just leaving. Oh, cool. There's a ghost coming onto the wall. I don't quite know what it is. I'm sorry. I'm not quite sure what it is that we have to do here. Jasper, go away! Oh, a candle. Oh, a piece of candy. Get up. Oh, <gasps> uh, why doesn't it default 
Hey, yes! Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I will. It's too dark to see. I can't put it here. Good. Because I was going to waste that. If... It's too dark to see. Okay, well, then what do I need? A gosh darned flashlight? To bring Jasper here and stab him through thy chest? Ooh. Don't mind if I do. Heck yeah. I played the first game on PS1 when I was a kid, and the roads coming to a dead end was really confused me. Yeah. So basically... With that kind of stuff, basically, once you're in, like, the other side, it keeps you contained to Silent Hill so that you can't leave Silent Hill, essentially. It doesn't want you to leave. There's something written on the candlestick. Holy flame. Could this be Silent Hill Woods? Yes. Okay, holy flame. Interesting. Like, for example, a thing that's different in the movie versus the game, Dahlia is Alessa's mom, which is true. Dahlia is Alessa's mom in the game, and I'm pretty sure also in the in in the movie and I'm pretty sure also in the game because I'm pretty sure that's what her name was but Dahlia in the movie was trying to save her daughter from the order whereas in the game Mama Dahlia ran the order basically and was trying to turn her daughter into this vessel um, kind of thing, like for lack of a better term, or I was like trying to unleash her true power. It was I something like that. Oh, I can finally see in here. My lights on. <laughs> I have lights in my closet. Okay, we need this silver bullet for Jasper. What unholy thing is waiting for me today? I've got a red piece of paper. Oh, no. It's one of those. Where is it? sounded like a cat that didn't sound like a baby i'm just gonna put that out there real quick where is the silver bullet thanks okay from it here that's normal um, that is also normal okay so this is all normal where is it I don't see it. What am I looking at? I don't know what to heal if I can't see it. Is it on the stop? Is 
is it in the fridge? Ah! Oh my god. Henry, you're literally gonna die. I can't stay close to it, so I'm hoping that will clear it up. And good. Okay. We have another note. There's a red piece of paper. My theory is that Walter never died at the prison. It may have been someone else who committed suicide. Either that, or the person with pol the police arrested was not the real Walter Sullivan. I'm in no position to investigate what really happened at the prison, but in any case, Walter didn't die at the prison. In any case, the man with the coat that showed up here was the real Walter. Seven years ago, he did something in that apartment. I'm certain there's a link between that and the bizarre things that keep happening here. Just a little bit more and I'll have this whole thing figured out. I may not even, I may even find that the real Walter is somewhere nearby. July 18th. Kitty, 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 things are... Getting weird. Hi, I'm back. Did you miss me? Okay, Jasper is this direction. Okay, I think what we're gonna do is I'll smack him a couple times with the normal bullets. And then I'll use the silver bullet. No, I don't want the sort of obedience. Okay, maybe he's not carrying anything. I want what's in his hand. I'm just making sure he's not actually holding something that I can take. No, okay, so we've got him taken care of. creepy somehow. Ooh, what's this? Is this something I can pick up? A saint medallion. Let's go this way. I'm sorry, what? There's a chain here? Take the chain? Eileen only weapon? Light and easy to use when snap could cause a lot of damage. Horse packing. I like horseback riding. I do not see crops in any other way besides like tools. <gasps> Eileen, hurry! Eileen! We gotta get out of here, babe. Come on, Eileen. Are you here? Okay, well, I have a feeling we're going to... Hey! Sorry, husky playing. They sound like they're killing each other. Anyways. Since we've seen Walter, I have a sneaking suspicion that we're going the correct direction. So, um... What do you see? Oh, the writing. Oh, all these holy candles are lit this time. They weren't last time. Ew. Oh, hey, well. It's too dark to see. 
I'm aware. <laughs> okay, where haven't we been? Oh, there's one place we definitely haven't been. Up the top, up in the top corner, the top left. Oh, hey, a candle. I can't hold anymore! A charred doll's body is sitting in the wheelchair. There's a message carved into it. Oh, Lord have mercy. Though my body be destroyed, I will not let you pass here. To prepare for the receiver of wisdom, I cut my body into five pieces and hid them in the darkness. When my body is once again whole, the path to below will be opened. If you are the receiver of wisdom, you will understand my words. The ritual has begun. The whale trolled. Okay, so we need all the doll parts. <laughs> what does that even mean? I haven't seen any doll parts. I'm assuming that we're going to get doll parts out of the well. Oh, hi. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Oh, hi, Lean. You're amazing. Could this be Silent Hill Woods? It is. Good job. Hi, I see you there. Let's go. Let's tussle. Where are you aiming? No smacking. No. No. I've already been shot. I don't need anything else happening to me. I can't hold anymore. Well. Pick it up. Okay, can I also... We don't need the silver bullet because we're already taking care of Jasper. Please. Please. Please, nobody. Got so many nutrition drinks. Oh, we can go through here now. Oh, hey, a holy candle. A holy flame. Can't hold anymore. That's revolver ammo. That's a portable med kit. And something's about to happen. Are you Walter Sullivan? That's what everybody calls me. But I don't really have a name or a home either. Well, what about a mom or dad? Yeah, but I never met them. They left South Ashfield Heights right after I was born. But soon I'll get to see my mom. Do you know where she is now? Yeah, of course. Right where I was born. Lots of people tried to stop me, but it's fine now. It says in the scriptures that I'll be with her. I gotta hurry. Mom's waiting. Okay. Okay, well, I apparently need whatever this is, so... I can read this writing. It looks like some kind of a diary. Here goes. Oh, October she can read it. I have to take a train or something to get to Ashfield. Everyone says Ashfield is a scary place, but I really want to see my mommy. <gasps> Eileen can read it! 
Okay, Eileen, wait here for me, babe. I gotta go, I gotta go drop some things. Well, mannequin parts, really. Hey, come read this one. What's this say? Here goes. February 10th. I went to visit Ashfield again. Again, I... Something, something, mommy. Some of it's blurred and I can't read past there. Thanks, Eileen. The upper body is missing. Was it some kind of goddess or something? Take the medallion. Crested medallion. Medallion with a disturbing emblem carved into it. It's about 10 centimeter, 10 inches in diameter. Ooh, I think this goes on that rock. <gasps> hey, Trevor. Thank you. Oh, I forgot that there's spooks in here. Come on. Can I pick this up? <gasps> Every time I look at it, it creeps me out even more. Take the pickaxe. Pickaxe of despair! Ordinary pickaxe from a construction site. Despair has been written in the handle. Very powerful. Oh, hell yeah. Ow, ow. Let me go! Yo. <gasps> wow. Ow. Come on. Eileen, leave him. We're going Minecraft on this side of the hill. <laughs> The pickaxe of despair. Where were we? Oh, yes. The depths of despair. <laughs> if you know what that's from, you're a cool person. Or you just know the meme. Okay. Hi, would you like to eat my pickaxe of despair? Oh, hey, come read this. Eileen, read it. Here goes. October 1st. He told me I could write whatever I wanted because nobody will ever see it. I like to write. My teacher taught me how. Hmm. Okay. Okay, Eileen. Oh, she's not looking good. Is there a way to heal Eileen? Like, legitimately, is there a way to heal Eileen? Asking because I don't actually know. I don't actually know if you can heal Eileen. No! You absolute asshole. I'm trying not to hit you with the pickaxe of despair! October 5th. I got hit again. I didn't do anything wrong. I wish he was dead. Damn. Okay, what about this one? Here goes. October 4th. My cheek hurts. I hate him. Oh, okay. I'm holding so many things. Is there a hole here? No, it's back. Too dark to see. Are you sure? What if I pickaxe it to death? All right, I'll go back. Hindsight, I know what I'm missing, and it drives me absolutely crazy. But you'll just have to wait to the next episode.